Hey guys, this is Garis again, and welcome to another episode of Survival Overdone. We are once again back in Extinction, and we are continuing our adventure. I am, or well, I did, some preparation of camp. I got a very nice level tech stego. It was a level 217 or something, I think. I pushed a few levels into it, into health and into damage. And we got... And another Argentavis, it was a level 104, I believe. I can't remember now. Oh, and we must make him a saddle. So this is preparation for the supply drops that I mentioned earlier, that we, or in the previous episode, that we're going to try and do in this episode. So, I have no idea what to expect of that waves. So that is why when I saw the text they go, I definitely thought, let's get it. So, and also guys, look at my number 8 slot. There's nothing there. Usually the spyglass is there. I removed it and I put back the awesome spyglass. So now we can finally have a hands-free spyglass again. So, but unfortunately we have a downside that we now have... We don't see the messages if we level up or pick up stuff or whatever. I see this says it's tameable, but I don't see any torpor with it. So, but I'm I saw that earlier. Oh, and another thing that is new: <laughs> our two massive quitters, a level 35 and a level 29. So I had very much luck getting those two. Um, let me just get on the archer quickly. The one was flying around here, so I shot him from here, standing up here, and the other was flying over there, and I shot him there, so, um, yeah, that was a lucky shot, or two lucky times, actually, so, okay, so what we're going to do today, guys, we're going to grab this Dextego, we're going to pick him up. And we're going to grab or this Archie and we're going to let the other two follow us. So let's just push. I'm trying to push damage on them so that they can do more damage. And then we're going to try and see if we can do any of those, um, those apply crates drops or whatever you call it. I have no idea what to expect. So let's go see first if we see one close to us so that we can get to it. It's usually a smoke column going up from it. Otherwise, I must just pause the recording and wait for one to come. Yep, I don't see one now. So let me pause the recording so I don't waste too much time. I'm going to wait till I see a smoke column and then I will bring you guys back in. I thought I'll quickly bring you guys in. I'm busy quickly taming a, another Argentavis, a 154. So, well, at least we got another Argentavis for our, to do our job. Maybe we should keep this one outside. Or maybe we can keep the black one and we don't need to lose the black one. I was uh, flying around on my potato don't looking for um, for um, the drops and I saw the 154 flying around here and I quickly set up a taming pen I have the, have the makings of a taming pen inside the pet trader dawn so that we can have an easy time once we find it because this is my scout that I go scouting with it's much faster so why not? Let's give it a few more levels. Um, yes, let's give him health. I'm not finding any of those drops. Usually there's one or two of them. And this time I'm not seeing even one. That's re very weird. Do they only spawn at a certain time of day though? It's early in the morning. Four hundred and eighty, that's not bad. 
Let's see, it's still busy being tamed. Oh, I killed him. Great. Well, that's a problem about the spyglass. You don't get the message immediately. So I'm going to do my scouting a little bit more. See if we can find it and then I'll bring you guys in. I'm just taming with normal um, raw prime meat. And I now see I have actually the spyglass. So we actually could have made proper kibble. Well, doesn't matter. I don't think we'll lose that much. Let's quickly see. What's the taming efficiency? 100%. So, uh, I'm not gonna cry over spilled milk. That's a saying, right? Crying over spilled milk. Yep, yeah, nope. Okay, so I'll bring you back. I'm gonna finish taming this and wait for the drop. And let's go try the waves. So I'll see you in a sec. Okay, we'll have to think about something else to do quickly because I went through the uh, or around sanctuary quickly and I didn't f see any of the supply drops. So I also got the um, Argent Davis over here. I think we're gonna keep a black one. I put it already put it back. So we're gonna fly this Argent Davis. So this was a 161. So this was a 154, right? I'm not gonna get worry about naming him. I just wanna take this one over further away from a teleporting pad. So what I was thinking, what we can do in the meantime, while we wait for the, that drop to come, let's go, now that we have the awesome spyglass, let's quickly go to the domes and go check what is a proper way of doing the tames. So I'm gonna try and go in the order that I got them originally. Whoa, that scared me. Okay, so first of all was the there this Bellinosaur. Base egg kibble. Don't know what that is. Oh well, raw mutton, so kinda we're on a spot with that one. Great. I don't know what a base egg kibble is. Okay, um, there wasn't another dino in the desert, right? Okay, so now let's go to the jungle on the sunken forest. Let's see what I say. Was that our next one? I believe it was. Okay. Let's quickly see. I believe this was actually a part that we didn't explore, and I believe it is in this direction. Direction. So, but I'm not gonna do another exploration episode. If we go there, when we're looking for something, then we can go there. But I'm not gonna do another exploration episode. So we did a lot of those already, and I think everyone had enough of those. So let's quickly see if we can find a gacha. Let's see the proper way to tame a gacha. It's just to find one. <laughs> What's this? This looks different. Oh no. Oh, yes. Oh, no. Is it yes or no? I can't... One second, please. Okay, sorry, I'm back. Yes, this is where we come in, came in. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, we got that gacha... Yeah, I'm so lost actually now. Is it over here, I believe? 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. What's over that side? Where's it? It's that red tree, right? I'm so confused now. Yeah, sorry, I haven't spent a lot of time down here. Ah, there's a gacha. Oh, and there's the dinosaurs. Awesome. Gotcha. Wow, that's a lot. Snow Elk Pallet. Awesome. So that is your favorite. What did we try to use? We, uh, what we tried to use wasn't even on a list. A generic resource. I believe that's what we tried to use. So element. Do they like element? Armor, weapon and consumables. Element ore. Where can we get element ore on this map? Um, okay, metal, ammo, stone, flint, wood. Okay, so yeah, snow owl pellets. Great. So we need snow owls to more snow owls to tame higher level gotchas. Level three. Come on. 28. Uh, not a lot. I believe... I'm still lost. <laughs> um, just want to try and figure out my direction quickly. When I get to the pad. This is where we tamed our first one. So it should be this side. Yes, there it is. No, nope, there. <laughs> Got confused between the two trees for a second there. Uh, that is why we must bring our Waven in. We must get to max level soon so that we can bring Helena over. Okay, so let's go to the snow, snow area. Ooh. What happened there? In any case, okay, snow elves, there's usually a lot of snow elves. There's one. Snow owl. Base egg kibble again. And raw mutton. Okay, we must figure out what the base egg kibble is. Okay, let's look for a mana... Mana garmer. Sorry, I had to <laughs> wait a second for that one. I'm in a garmers. That was a fun time in the previous episode, wasn't it, guys? <laughs> I had to tank that one. I actually must check out what um, Dota Dex is regarding the mana garmer. Because that's usually the tool I use to tame, to work out the uh, kibble amount and so on. So, tip for you guys, if you don't use this um, spyglass, use the uh, dodo decks, you can add your server rates. Or if you play single player, you can use single player rates and if you modify it, you can put it there. It's, it's on Android devices and I believe probably i store as well this one which direction is that okay so it's at the east side of sanctuary so usually it's a stay a while oh wow that's going to be a long flight actually um pondering if we should wait for one that's closer to us i believe so I believe I'm going to do that. I'm just quite looking for a mana armor quickly. So you can see what's a proper way of taming those things. Come on, where are you? Now they are uh, somewhat scarce. Well, in my findings that is. I 
I don't know if you should play, maybe play more in a snow dome before they spawn more, maybe, or something. I must actually be on the lookout as well for high level of snow elves. While well, I'm here though. Snow elf 5, yeah that's high level. Come on, I'm looking for you Manny. And no, I'm not saying Manny for a um, mammoth, like in the... What's that story? Um, Ice Age. Yeah. No, it's just a Managarmer. It's quicker saying that. Come on, Snell. Snell! Show me your Snell. You see, in this one, picks up diners much quicker than the normal of the other spyglass I used to use. Of the other place, I found the. Um, the sheep was here. Ah, yeah, Perlovia, nice. Sabertooth. Okay, I must land soon. Stamina is gonna go low soon. Okay, let me fly around a bit to see if I can find a mana armor before I look at it with the spyglass. So that I don't spoil it. I say that and yet I don't pause the video. <laughs> Let's quickly check up here. I know there was one up here too, right? The one that we lost. The one that got away. There's, a, there's one, there's one, there's one. Let's just go up a bit so it doesn't attack us. It still shot at us. Oh, man, 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 a gomer was there. Base equable and. Come on. So everything is base equable, and I believe I saw a Rob Martin there. So, yeah, we were kind of on a right track. So let me get back to base and see how close that drop was to us and then I'll bring you back in once we can go and do the the stages or the waves actually so I'll bring you back right right in blah, blah, blah. I'll bring you right back okay guys um, there is one finally spawned it is actually now the next day <laughs> I've been waiting around so long that I thought, okay, I'm logging for the night and then I came back, waited around, waited around and I went AFK for a bit and when I came back, there it is. So I'm not sure if there's a time limit on one of those, so let's quickly see if we can go do this thing. Okay, just want to make sure everything is in attack your target, attack your target, neutral. Behavior, attack your target, and this also why? Uh, behavior, behavior. Attack your target, and the most important one, this one, attacking target. Oh, no, nope. I want to pick you up. And then we're riding this one, right? This white one is actually also nice. Let's just take the two big ones. Why not? I don't see why we should take too many days. I quickly flew by to see if I can see a time. I can't remember the previous time if we when we scouted one. If there was a time limit or not. But... Um, I checked and I couldn't see one. I didn't climb off because there were two Rexes. So I don't know if that has anything to do with the... Um, with waves, maybe. So, but let's attack them. Let's see. 
And the boy strikes out the other or so. Corrupted strikes. Okay. Okay. Other one. Okay, let's take on the corrupted things because I'm thinking. Okay, here's a red one. So maybe that has something to do with the. I have no idea what's going on here. And that's probably very apparent. Let's see. Initiating sequence. Hostiles approach approaching. I don't just wanna throw down the the um parasaur. to see what is going on okay we don't have a lot of time so I hope it doesn't this doesn't take long and I hope it's not Reaper Kings and Queens then I'm just giving up straight away seven hostiles remaining okay where is the hostiles I don't know. Are they gonna come here or do we gonna have to go search for them? How does this work? I don't get it. There's a corrupted um, pterodon. Maybe it's that thing. Let's go attack it and see what the remaining hostile count is. And there's a Thylar Cleo. Okay, that was quick. Let's kill the... Okay, one... We killed one, let's see. Still seven remaining. Let's kill this one. Seven remaining. Okay, so what must we kill? It did say hostiles incoming, so I don't know what's going on. There's. Oh. Okay. Maybe. Oh. Okay, okay, I get it. Okay, so they come from outside the shield, and the shield is protecting this device. All styles approaching. Okay, so they do come from outside. So the first ones was Dylos. Let's just put this on number eight. I keep forgetting to do this. Oh, here we go. And here's another one. Oh, here they come. <laughs> Love it. I just want to get this out of the way quickly. Let's see if we get any other messages. Okay, let's see how many... Oh, there's two more. Oh no, that's scared. 
scared ones, so it's definitely not those. 28 hostiles remaining. What? Okay. Here they come. Look behind you guys. Okay, so it's just corrupt the things that it's coming. Okay. Okay, with a. It seems like if you get a nice high Rex, you'd be able to take this. But the problem is. He's a. Um, Flyers. Take that one. Okay. How many is left? I think I saw the numbers now. One of us still remaining. Okay, great. Where's that one? Oh, there it is. Oh, Tech Force Field. Oh, goodness. Okay, so we must protect the Force Field as well. Oh, goodness gracious. Demolish in... Minus 14. Well, I'm guessing the other wave is going to come from this side. Yep. Okay, so we must protect the force field. Protect the force field! Hopefully we don't damage it at all. Yeah, come attack me, please. Come attack me. You don't need to attack the dome. Not at all. Okay. And this way we figure him out little by little. There's one come incoming. Oh, nope. Not incoming. Okay. Tech Force Field seems to be holding at 500. 28 hostiles remaining. Okay, here they come. I'm just trying to scout and see if something else attacks the forces from a different location or direction. Where do you think you're going, mate? I wish I could have put them on aggro, but in a lower range. So that they keep following me and don't just go off and kill everything in their path. Oh, there's one attacking. What do you think you're doing? Okay, so it, at least it does seem like it's only the corrupted. Okay, that means a wave is done. Uh, if I saw correctly, it's 400 left of a shield. So let's see. What's next? Okay, the Archies wasn't too bad a choice though. All styles approaching. How many are do we have? Four 
47. Oh my goodness. Okay. There's one charging. Yep, here they come. Okay. So that wasn't something major yet. Here comes a Stego Raptors. Nice. Okay, so the difficulty does increase a bit by bit. There we go. Just be careful not to stand still ar around a raptor for too long on the RG because they do jump you off. And I promise you that is not fun. Shield, shield, how's the shield rolling up? 4,000, great. And here is a bunch of small ones coming. Where's our Archie? Oh, there it is. No, 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 no. Stay away from my shield. Okay, this is a somewhat tower defense type of thingy, I guess. Maybe we should put up towers. <laughs> defense towers, that would be fun. Yo! Oh. Kill, 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 kill. Okay. Okay, that's another wave done. Great. How is it you doing? Your health is good. 1.5. Other one. 1.5. Okay, everyone is 1.5. Dex force field is at 44. 100. 30 or Okay. Thirty hostiles. I'm guessing it's going to be bigger because the previous one was forty-eight. Oh goodness! I hope it's not corruptors. Co oh, not um, corruptors. Kings. I don't like the king's stuff. Look at this one. How do you think you're biting? No time to stand still. Okay, so this is actually a long thing to get supplies. I hope it's worth it. Okay, I think I can even still take a corrupted Rex, but I really don't want to do the corrupted um, kings, Reaper kings, and stuff. Oh, and other thing, we don't have a light bit. So that's gonna be fun. I think for the next one, I'm gonna make a mobile tank. Take a paraser, put a saddle on it. Or platform saddle. a bunch of guns on it and just teleport it to the to the um, this dome. How much do we have left of this dome? Come on. Oh, 39. Okay, so it got hit. How many do we have left? I believe this is the fifth one. Yes, all stars approaching. I'm going to check something, if I can damage this shield myself. Come on, away. Nope, 
No. We can test that in a different time. Maybe we can. Oh, we can damage it. Oh, 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 okay. Okay, so maybe some of that damage was definitely from me. Okay, so we must block them before it comes. Is this one for meant for us? I hope not. We're getting a bunch of this corrupted modules. I still have no idea what to use that for. Let's just kill it because it is corrupted and it can attack our shield. Okay, doesn't seem like. Ooh. Yeah, just aggro on me. Just leave a shield with me, please. It's my shield. Can't have my shield. <laughs> I hope it's not dependent on how much or what type of um, creatures comes in. So, meaning if we get Rex is coming in, then it's better gear. As if just Dylos attack us, it's um, less better gear. Uh, <laughs> less better. My English are delicious today. Yeah, that that was. Um, no, I can't get the word. Oh wait. No, serious. Two assaults remaining. The problem is there's a meteor shower. I think we should fly for it. The problem is, this meteors can actually kill us one shot. Oh goodness gracious! Come on, Archies! Come on! Come on! I hope it's a part of a wave. I really do not hope it. Okay, that's one Dilo left, so let's leave him there. He won't, uh, hopefully, he won't get through the shield while the shower is active. <sighs> Goodness. Okay, so this was not necessary. Okay, well that means we won. OSD defense complete. Okay, so please don't go get it go go away. Please don't go away. I wanna risk it. Oh goodness. What does it say more corrupted creatures? Incredibly hazardous to it. Human health if consumed. Please don't go away. I'm so scared it's gonna go away. But what can we lose? What can't we lose? What can we lose? Okay, let's see. If take a potato down, maybe. Level 300. Wait, I have level, lower levels ones that I can risk. Yep, level 65. Follow me.
Why didn't that one wanna... Oh, it was probably group whistle disabled. I wanna go see what that is. Okay, let's level... Stamina... And movement. So that we can maybe get out of there quickly. I have a lot of meat on me that I'm gonna lose. Well, let's go. Just stay away from the corrupted dinos. This pterodon is not strong at all. Check items. Okay. Does not seem like there's a time limit, so I'm not gonna eject them. Grab them and fly back and lose them though. So I really don't want to do that. Okay, let me wait till the meteor shower is done and then I'll bring you guys back just to see what we got. Uh, because we are running out of time. Oh, that one was close. I think. <laughs> I didn't see that. It sounded like it. So I'll bring you right back after the meteor shower. It looks like it is done now, finally. And that's another... Oh no! No, 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 no. No, that sucks. <laughs> okay, well, at least we know now how it works. Oh, goodness. That, maybe the meteor shower accompanies that. Oh, goodness. Well, at least we had fun destroying all the the um, corrupted creatures, and we got a bunch of XP. So, not me myself, but the Archie had 8 levels, I believe. So that is good, so we can push a little bit more into damage and all the Archies, because I'm sure the other ones also got some levels. But for now, I'm gonna call it a day, guys. This was kind of a waste, because we didn't find our loot. We should have ejected it. I should have taken a chance. I could have recovered my body at least. Of the loot stuff. So I will do that definitely next time if another one drops by. We saw one dropping there but I'm not gonna go for that one now. I'll do one off cam and hopefully I can catch it on cam and then I can keep that clip for the next episode that we ca I can show you guys how um, what loot we get so but in any case guys thank you for joining me I hope you enjoyed this episode sorry to drag out a bit again well seems like most of my episodes these days drag out a bit but I appreciate you guys sticking to the end and please remember to subscribe and leave a like or a dislike if you prefer and if you do leave a dislike please just tell me why so that I can work on my content and make the content more enjoyable for everyone so thank you once again for joining me guys i will see you in the next one cheers